Hey guys, this is kind of a video response to my very old um, How I Make a Fursuit Head, which when I first started I used cardboard to do that stuff, and apparently since now I've moved to foam, which is better. Um, some people don't believe me that I make my heads with foam now, for some reason. <laughs> so I am here to show you that I have been doing my heads with foam now. I have gotten rid of my um, heads that I made with cardboard, so now all I do have is my foam heads. and. You've seen this one. This one is my newer Sayu head. I will show you a picture of my older Sayu. I can't really get good lighting in here, <laughs> but there's foam. The whole head is foam. And especially for this one, see the foam? Yes. I'm showing you this one especially because it's my misery head. And as for everyone else who has seen my very, very old uh, How I Make Fursuit Head tutorials, this was the head that you saw in that video, except I remade this one out of foam. This is a picture I have of my old head. Like I said, I got rid of my old head. I tore it up and everything. <laughs> I had fun tearing it up, but you know, this is the old head. This is the new head. So you can totally tell a difference, I hope, out of the picture and what I have in my hand right now. And of course, I take commissions, so I have heads all over the place. And I mean all over the place. This one is made out of balaclava. And I, I don't really like messing with balaclava, so there's him. That one belongs to my husband right now. And this I'm showing you as proof that I also use tape to get the patterns before I put it onto the face. And I have been adding TVs to some or most of them as of recently too. So, yeah. You can start with making cardboard or whatever if you want a quick go about that is less hassle and way more clean. But I advise you use it for like two or three years, like I have done, but gain the money up and finally get foam and start trying, you know, making foam heads. Because yes, they're both experiences all on themselves and it probably might be easier to make cardboard heads, but also that is only for you guys. As... I mean that by cardboard would be just for your self-use. This is not, that was not of any means to, to make for commissions or anything. So if you want to get into commissioning, that has to be foam because you don't know how well like throwing in a box would hold up against everything. How, how dangerous, for lack of a better word in my head right now, it would be for someone to roll around in the head all year long or whatever. Yeah. They are a bit harder to upkeep, but you can upkeep them with spotting, with, you know, soap or whatever, cleaning the face. Just like a foam head for the ones that I had for like three years or so. So yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to kind of update that video on how I make fursuit heads now compared to like three or four years ago, however long ago that was. 
so thanks for watching and please remember what I just said <laughs> that all my heads are foam based now and cardboard is totally out of the picture it's for personal use only for maybe I don't know depends how long you wear it but maybe three years tops so there you go. I'm still keeping my own video up though so people can use it because it is usable. It is wearable. And it does function, you know, pretty much the same. It just takes shorter to get to have to be remade. <laughs> so thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you like this video or other videos like this on my channel. Post this video up or down. I don't really mind. It helps more when it gets thumbed up, I guess. But that's your choice too. Um, and I'll see you later. Bye.